We begin tonight in Aransas County where two dogs assisting sheriff's deputies in a manhunt for what officials say were illegal immigrants were killed. The Aransas County Sheriff's Office says six people were arrested just north of Holiday Beach yesterday. In tonight's top story, Artila Alanis explains what exactly happened. Yeah, Michelle, that manhunt started as a traffic stop on Highway 35, but then the black truck sped off and went through a fence line before stopping. That's when sheriff's deputies say at least 14 to 16 people scattered into the brush. The Department of Public Safety, Texas Parks and Wildlife, and Refugio rancher Joe Brayman were called in to help search. Brayman provides assistance, including dogs that are trained to help law enforcement. And this time around, Brayman sent in two non-aggressive dogs no bite dogs, in fact, that often help find individuals with Alzheimer's and dementia. With agencies both on foot and horseback, they were able to find and arrest five people, but a third yelled out in Spanish, if you want me, come and find me. That's when two of the dogs were found dead nearby and the sixth person was arrested. I overheard one of the suspects saying he was a uh, gang affiliated. You know, just, just the fact that we took those people off the street, you know, it was just... Unfortunately, a canine that lost their life. Sheriff's deputies say one of the suspects had apparently strangled the dogs with their collars that had trackers on them. After being detained and interviewed by U.S. Border Patrol officials, it was determined that the people came from Mexico, Guatemala, and Honduras. The five men and one woman were taken away from Aransas County Detention Center to U.S. Customs and Immigration. 